Hey everybody, this is Night Yoshi here, and today let's play Super Smash Bros. Melee on the Nintendo GameCube. Before I actually get started, though, I'm going to play the intro this time because, well, I forgot to play in the first two parts because I was so excited to play the game. Yeah, I know. I'm an idiot sometimes. I will openly admit I'm not perfect. I've openly admitted that plenty of times, but. I guess I do overdo that a little bit, don't I? But anyways, this is the intro playing, and I gotta say, this is one of the most exciting intros to any game I've ever played. Possibly the best GameCube intro of all. Because it really gets me excited to play the game. And just look at all these awesome characters. I gotta say, this is a very uh, funny moment, not there. But up here, Kirby just going around and... Yeah. Then we got Star Fox fighting Wolf, who did appear in Brawl. And a bunch of Pokemon. Captain Falcon. I mean, like, just wow. It really makes you just want to hit start right away and start playing now. It is awesome. Get ready. Ho <laughs> ho ho ho! Oh my god, so much, so many memories from that. Oh my god. I love it. Alright. Let's get on to the game. Now, this one was, I'm going to be going through as Luigi. This one was requested by the Sonic Smasher. I hope you enjoy, and like with Mario, I can't do it on normal. I tried dozens of times. I flat out can't do it. So here's all the colors for Mar or Luigi and... That's the color I'm going with. I hope you don't mind. Alright, so first opponent is Fox. And, uh, yeah. Luigi's definitely... De I can't pronounce words right today. Definitely an interesting character. Because a lot of his things, like that punch there, are completely random. Like, you know how uh, Mario had the coin attack? Luigi's got it here, but sometimes he'll have... A an exploding effect, and oddly enough, I have Fox as my partner now. That little sailor dive thing I just did. Uh, dang, I'm getting lucky with that punch again. So, anyways, with that, and the sailor dive, as I call it, I'm not sure if that's the official name. Like, sometimes it'll have an exploding effect, but most of the time it won't. It's just completely random. And this is one of the oddest break the target targets in the entire game, I think. It's just this one room with a bunch of targets, a bunch of flippers, and a small hole that you can fall in if you're not careful. And that's it. So, really, this is one of the easiest, I think. There's really no way you're going to lose unless you somehow fall into the hole, but I don't think I... I can't recall... Wow, I beat my own record. Wow. I don't recall a single time I've fallen down there. Probably did as a kid, but I can't for the life of me remember. So up against the Ice Climbers now. Again, okay, there's the coin thing. I found. What the heck? There's seriously a hammer in that little capsule? You already got hammers, you freaking jerk-offs. Alright. Screw you. I got a sword now, and now I don't. Yeah. I think I demonstrated that twice now. The coin thing. Yeah, Luigi's got a lot of the same moves as Mario. But that doesn't mean he's a com complete clone. He actually does have some unique things about him. And I will try to point out all of them. So up against giant Donkey Kong now. One thing that's really interesting. Luigi's taunt will actually do damage. I'm not kidding. It's the only one I know of that actually does damage. I'm, I'm going to try and demonstrate on Donkey Kong here if I can get him, get him down here. I think he's going... No, he didn't land. Alright, let's see if he'll jump down for me. No? Come on. I really want to demonstrate this. If I have to, I'll go to practice mode and do it, but... Yeah, the freaking partners are making it hard to do. Screw it. I will show it off one way or another, whether it's... an adventure or... all-star or practice mode. I will show it off. So, snag the trophies now. Let's snag some trophies and... 
other than some, some of the character ones, I think I got all the... That was a stupid move. I think I got all of them now. I can't confirm that, though. So I got six... I got one. Cool. Oddly enough, the next character I'm doing for uh, Kirby Master Ultra. Alright, so... Let's, uh... Yeah. Let's see if I can actually start beating on him. It the other way around. Jeez, he's just spamming the crap out of me. So that's one different move that Luigi has is the run and punch. I definitely like it. It's a fun move to use, I think. And uh, that thing is a little different than Mario's fire hit thing. I don't know what it's called off the top of my head. I could probably look in the manual, but I don't want to. Are you up to the team battle? This is going by really quick. And it's interesting to note on team battles, the coin thing is worthless. Unless it, it's the exploding one. In fact, I'm going to stand by my Pokemon here. He's going to protect me. Yet, he didn't eliminate too many, did he? That was kind of worthless. Now, the spin attack against the team... Unlike Mario, it works a lot better. I don't know if, if it's just more powerful or what, but it is very effective. And I love it for that. And, yeah, Red Shell. Pretty self-explanatory. So, already done with that. Now, for the race to finish. Yeah, we got 53 seconds this time. I think, I think all the other times we had 54, I can't confirm that. Luigi's not too very very good with this one, though. You know, with Mario's third jump thing, he went forward a bit. With Luigi's, he just goes straight up. And I missed the trophy. Whoops. That is a bit of a problem in some cases. In other cases, it's actually good. And for here, we're going to be taking the middle path. Or path, not path. Whoops. I can't pronounce anything right today, can I? Middle path. And this is definitely my least favorite. Freaking lava. If you can avoid it, good. Because it will send you flying. It sucks. And well, yeah, like that. Alright, I'm tempted to go up there, but let's see what's down here. Yeah, that's... That didn't go well. Oh well. I think I got all the trophies other than some of the character ones because when I go to the lottery thing it just says uh, zero percent of getting new trophy no matter what I say and that was a very quick battle with Metal Link. But you get the idea. So I think by the time this LP series is complete I will have all the trophies which would be really freaking awesome. Now, Master Hand in particular is a little harder with Luigi than Mario or Yoshi because he doesn't have a spin attack like like uh, Mario did. One nice thing is uh, Luigi's fireballs defy gravity. I'm not even kidding, that's what the trophy says on them. So, with those, they just kind of float all over. Which is helpful in some cases, but in others, not so much. Again, Luigi's kind of a, you know, complete, a bit of a luck character in a way. Random and luck, really, is what defies him the most from Mario, which is an interesting idea. I do think he is executed pretty well, at least in this one. I'm not so sure about Brawl and the N64 one. I don't know, I just haven't played it with him enough in those ones to really say much. But, yeah. Luigi rocks. We already knew that. I also think uh, Luigi's fireballs might have a shorter range than Mario's. I can't confirm that. But, I think so. He also has better jump. Like, he can jump higher than Mario. Like in Super Mario Bros. 2. Or some people call it Doki, Doki Panic or whatever. Like... No, screw that. I call it Super Mario Brothers 2. And I just got kind of screwed because he broke my shield. 
but uh, he's almost finished. Just ah crap. Oh sweet, and finish him off with that. So yeah, I think I pretty much said everything I wanted to say. So yeah, Luigi isn't a complete clone of Mario, like I already said. He does have his differences, but in some ways he is similar. He has a few of the same attacks, but they're altered differently, like the spinning punch thing that I used against the uh, Mr. Game & Watches. You can actually um, move slightly with that. And uh, another weird thing is that the opponent doesn't get stuck in it like with uh, Mario. It just, they just kind of bounce away. So, yeah. Good against teams, not so much against one other fighter, though. And, of course, I skipped through the credits because they SUCK! But not this video. This video is actually pretty cool. Yeah. And that's a pretty comedic picture there. Luigi got revenge, I guess. I don't know what for, though. I guess me and Mario turned off his nightlight or something. <laughs> no, not really. Alright, now on to adventure again, easy mode. This time around we're actually going to be trying out uh, the thing Kirby Master Ultra told me about. Holding down the L and R buttons and getting different music on the Soto stage. If that does work, I'm going to try it out on a few other stages too, like maybe one or two. Probably just one though. But if it does work once, then I will want to try it again to see if it works other places too. And Giant Luigi sounds pretty funny. Well, there's not much left to say as far as adventure mode since I pretty much said it all. There's a good shell there. So, yeah. I pretty much said all there is to say about Luigi and uh, adventure modes. I don't know what to talk about now. Well, that worked. Pretty well. Alright, let's get up here and just, you know, take out the Yoshi team again. Again, team battles, pretty much worthless with the coin thing unless you get lucky. Like I was earlier, I had the you know, exploit thing work a few times. Another thing about the spin punch or tornado punch, whatever it wants to be called. Maybe it's called the Luigi Tornado or something. I don't even know. I'm just coming up with names now, I bet. Is uh, you can actually move slightly with it. Now, I'm hoping this time Luigi appears instead of uh, Mario, because I really want to show that. There we go! So Mario jumps, and then this happens. I still laugh at that to this day. That is just so funny to me. Okay, so now we're fighting Luigi and Peach. And oddly enough, Peach is in her uh, Daisy alternate outfit. I don't know, I, I kind of wish Daisy was in the series rather than just a costume of Peaches. I don't know why, but I think that would be a little bit better. But always like, oh, Pokeball, I want that. I want that. Parasol too. Pokeball goes first, though. Yeah, Mary Poppins style! You know, I'm not a big fan of the Mary Poppins series. And I still got to demonstrate that taunt, taunting with Luigi does hurt the opponent, do I? Don't I? Get my grammar and pronunciations wrong today. Alright, let's try real quick. Yes, there we go. See? That was the taunt. And it does hurt the opponent. 1% only, but it hurts them. It's the only taunt in the game that I know of that actually hurts. Which is very odd to me. Another thing you notice about the coin jump thing, that. And Brawl, when Luigi did that, he'd flip upside down and land on his head. He doesn't do that here. It is comedic and all, but I kind of like it when he does it personally. And freaking Donkey Kong got the... Wow, that worked out very well, actually. All right. So now we gotta beat up Donkey Kong, giant Donkey Kong. And I do want that warp star. Give me. 
and leave that bomb there for him, and somehow he avoided it. That sucks. See if I can get him over there. Oh, there we go. Yes! Perfect! Alright, now I'm holding down L and R. Let's see if this works. I'm really hoping it does. Come on, I want to hear the awesome music. Yes! Alright, now we're talking. Not that the Zelda music is bad, but this to me is not only better, but also a lot more fitting, I think. I don't know, I just love it, what can I say? There's nothing left I can say about it. It is that dang good! I love it. I know, I said that a million times now. But I really do. Alright, so... Yeah. <laughs> and freaking Like Like got me. I'm, I assume it's a Like Like. Because it's a tube-like creature. Like in the NES game. I, please don't quote me on that though, because I can't confirm it. And dang it, I thought I avoided it. But no, now we weird. I fought the Link wearing black, and now I'm fighting the one wearing white. Like Pokemon black and white. That's a little weird to me now that I think about it. I don't even know why I brought that up. I guess I just got Pokemon on the mind right now. And yeah, <laughs> I took care of him. Got a fan out of that. Oh, trophy. But, like I said, I'm pretty sure I have them all. Alright, we're going to go down another level. See if it's in here. No. Alright. So now we're fighting the Lincoln Red. I don't even know why I'm pointing out the colors. You can clearly see them. There's a metal box. You can destroy it by... Hitting it like with a fireball or something. It's a little weird to me. I imagine the box would be on metal too. And that's one thing about Link. Even though I haven't played as him, I will mention it. Sword battle! Anyways, with his shield, he can actually block some attacks without him using the shield. Which to me, that's cheating! Which is good for me because I like to cheat sometimes. Not against other players. Against the freaking AI, I say go for it. They deserve it. Sometimes. So there's the Triforce. There we go. Alright, so I can confirm that the little LNR trick for different music does indeed work. And I will try that again at least one more time. To see if it works anywhere else. I could probably try it out everywhere, but I'd rather not. Just because, I don't know. Maybe I will. Maybe I won't. And I was very lucky that she landed on that somehow. Alright. So next we got uh, Bryn Star. Samus, all that. Let's take her out. Alright, so, yeah. There's nothing left to say on Adventure Mode or this battle in general. You've all heard what I said before, unless you didn't check out the first two. But if you didn't, okay. You might want to check them out, though, if you want my opinions and whatnot. Alright, there's a Pokeball down there. I definitely want that. As soon as I can get past her. That worked. There's milk right there, but... I think the lobs coming up soon, so oh crap. Ow, crap. Oh she got it. Dang it. I wanted that. Maximum tomato for me, fortunately I do need that. Ah oh, come on. Lava rises right as I get a freaking hammer. That is bull crap beyond belief. Let's try it again. Yes. That is more like it. Alright, sweet. And warning once again. Yes, again, I, I know I said it all, so there's really no point of going into detail. Now this one with Luigi, oh, trophy. Now this one with Luigi, 
I'd say it's about the same as Mario. Mario's might be a little bit easier in some cases, but Luigi's might be as well, because sometimes you want to, you know, go straight up with the third jump, like right there, for example. But other times, you'd want to go partially the other way. I don't know, it just really depends on you. Now, I'm holding down L and R, so let's see if it works with uh, Kirby's Land. I bet anything it will. I hope. Yes, it does work. And this, I do like this music. I'd say it's tied with the other track, though. I mean, the, this one and the other Kirby one that would have been playing if I didn't hold the L and R buttons are both pretty freaking good regardless, so, yeah. If you want to change the music there, I say go for it. I might, might not. I like both tracks, so. Yeah, this is the music that would have been playing if I didn't hold down L and R. And god dang it, they freaking teaming up on me. Freaking Bowser Kirby. I don't like you, go away. Pokemon Ball. And got Caesar, I think he's called. Game Watch Kirby, Luigi Kirby, Pikachu, and Jigglypuff Kirby, Pichu. Okay, that's really ironic because they're all Pokemon based. And it's all over. Yay! Oh, nope, not yet. Still gotta go through giant Kirby. That's what happens when Kirby finds steroids. Or maybe just exercise a lot. I don't know. I don't know the whole story with that, and I really don't care to find out. That was a you gotta admit that was a slick move using the bomb there and the fireball. I'm sure I'm not the one first one to do it, but still regardless. Gotta admit it's that's kind of a smart idea. Avoid him sucking me up with that. Throw a fireball at him and all that good stuff. Try and keep him off. Sword! Which I didn't even need. Okay, now. Now, the next is Fox, and I am seriously hoping this time I freaking get Fox the second time around. Seriously, I want to show that off so badly. But so far, I have gotten no luck. It's ridiculous. I don't know what it is. And I just finished off Fox really quick. Alright. So let's see what happens. Huh? <laughs> okay, I don't even care that I didn't get Fox. That is funny. <laughs> Reference Star Fox 64. That is awesome. I love that game, though. Star Fox 64. That is a really fun one. I feel bad for anyone who has not played that game. You can't call yourself a gamer without playing Star Fox 64. It is one of the best. And I KO'd Falco really quick. So on to Pokemon Stadium. This will probably be the last one before I have to charge my camera battery. It's almost dead. See how it goes first. Like I said, coins are worthless, so do this. Spin attack. Pokeballs. Mine. Oh, figures I get chancy. You kidding me, Jigglypuff got Blastoise. Oh, screw you. Screw you. Okay, I want that one. I don't know if I had got that one or not, but it's not a dangerous one. And that's teasing me there. There are two Pokeballs right there, and I can't get them. Oh, well, done. Well, actually, I might be able to make it through the race part before I have to charge my battery now, so without quick that went. Let's see what happens. If I ever get a request to do uh, Yoshi in a different color, I'm definitely going to have to use the egg roll thing throughout the entire race. That would just be awesome. Except for the jumps, of course. I would fall if I did that. Alright. I'm pretty sure I can make it. Oh. Hey, if I didn't stop too early. Yeah, I would have made that if I hadn't stopped so early. So, yes, Luigi can make it there. Oh, trophy. Luigi can make it there. I just screwed up. Do not let the video fool you. And, oh, crap. I did not want that. Oh, crap. Oh, oh, oh. Goodness, that was close. 
Okay, I gotta get someplace to hide quick. Cause they're coming. Oh crap. I think I'll just hang here. Actually, I might have been able to jump up and duck there to avoid that all. But I'm not willing to risk it. Or wasn't able, willing to. And I'm just going to wait here for them to go. Technically, I can go right there, though. In fact, why didn't I? Because I really didn't want to get hit. Oh, well. Finished. And battery still has a bar left, so I guess I can do the next fight with Captain Falcon. Yeah, Captain Falcon. I'm not very good with him, yet he always finds a way to beat the crap out of me. Not so much right now, though. Right now, I'm handing him a beating. Like that. Aw, oh, dang, he even avoided that. That would have been a perfect hit. Well, not perfect, but probably would have knocked him out. I think it would have. I can't confirm that because I didn't succeed. Alright, I got a hammer here, so this will knock him out. Yeah. Falcon Punch cannot compete with the mighty hammer. Because it's hammer time! Alright. It's still going strong. I am amazed with my camera battery now. And. Okay, I was not holding LNR. Yet, all of a sudden, we got different music. Okay, that is very weird to me, actually. Like, like very weird. I wasn't holding LNR, like I said. Now, all of a sudden, it's playing completely different music. That's just odd to me. Oh, well. It's not bad, though. I like the other track better, though, just because it's... A little bit more fitting, I think. This one's a little too cheery for me. Okay, now I know I have to charge the battery. Alright, so, hold on a second. Okay, here we go, resuming. And I got the awesome 8-bit music, yay! And I don't want to brag here, but you gotta admit that double elimination throw I did in, against uh, the Team Nez last back there, that was pretty awesome, wasn't it? So yeah, this is, ouch, I want to keep that Pokeball right there, I want that, and I don't want to throw that until I'm at the top. Anyone that's watched the other two videos know why, so I won't bother explaining again, but yeah, and now it's starting to go faster, means I gotta hurry up, go, 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 go. Alright, there we go. Okay, a bit disappointing, but whatever. Oh, there's a tomato up there. I definitely want that. And, oh, double elimination. Or, triple elimination? Wow. Okay, that is awesome. Going all metal style. Your hammer has nothing on my metal. So, yeah, that, that was quick. Quicker than I expected. Okay, now here, I already said, screw the coins for Luigi, at least. It doesn't work very well. Just do the spin attack. Yeah. And uh, believe it or not, for uh, the event challenges, one of the multi-man melee battles is a hundred of them. I've only beaten that once with Donkey Kong because he has the ground slap move. But I could see it working very well with Luigi too, and oddly enough, I'm jumping like I'm on the moon. I don't recall that, but of course I typically don't jump that much during this battle. Anyways, that's done. Metal Mario, Metal Luigi. They must be metalheads. Ha ha! Metalheads like me. And they're double teaming me. We're gonna have to change that. Yeah. Throw them at each other. They're both metal. They'll hurt each other badly. Makes perfect sense. And I'm gonna knock that barrel off and lose the item. 
Whoops. Oh, well, Metal Mario is damaged enough, and there we go. Now we just gotta toss Metal Luigi off. There may only be one. You shall not pass. Yeah, I know I saw nothing like Gandalf. Looking forward to seeing the Hobbit, though. Alright, so now we got Bowser. Again, Gaia Bowser will not appear on easy. Which is a little disappointing. I know. I'm sorry. I tried, though. Well, not so much Adventure Mode. I wish I had. But oh well. Let's see if I can get him out of here. Fireballs, all that good stuff. Another thing I forgot to mention with the other two, you can actually beat on them while you're holding on to them. You can, uh press the Z button, the same button you use to grab them and just beat on them. Get a few hits in, you know, which is awesome. And that went very quick. Wow. I did not expect to finish him that fast. Wow. I love the way Luigi says that. That is awesome. So, now we get the trophy again. Well, new one. And I gotta say, I like this one. Shows him doing his little taunt. I like it. So, now we go to the credits, which we are fast forward again, because they suck! I think that's one thing everyone can agree on. Credits in video games suck! They suck! I don't know why I have such a grudge against them. I guess I've, because I've wasted so much time on them. I could always just walk out of the, other, out of the room and wait, I know. But then I won't know when they're done. And I love this picture. Donkey Kong trying to do the hand slap on Luigi. But he just goes right over him. And Kirby's just like, eh, who gives a crap. He's like, eh, I don't care. You guys aren't cool. I don't know. Yeah. So now we're going to All-Star. Very easy. Yes, I know. This is going to be quick. Which sucks. And yeah, we're up against Link first. See how well I do, and uh, dang it, missed him with the Warp Star crap. That sucked. Aw, oh, dang it, he, he slashed me. How dare you? That could have hurt me. Okay, it did hurt me somewhat. And uh, that's it. That's the first bow. Uh, I hope I'm not getting, getting a cold. And now we're up against Young Leaf. That is very ironic to me. And I, I still don't understand why we're on Donkey Kong stage, in all honesty. Is there, like, any reason for this? Does Cranky like Young Link? Because I highly doubt that. Oh, got a moment. Oh, I just perfectly nailed him. Wow. You gotta admit, that was a good shot. Alright, so, oh. Overshot it. Up against Pikachu now. Pika Pika! Yeah, Pikachu in his green hat. I'm gonna get out of this one without taking any damage. That's it? Really? Really? Okay. Alright, next is Luigi. I, I can't get over that. I, one capsule knocked Pikachu out? Okay, I'm very lucky that I hit the bricks there, otherwise I might have undershot it and, uh, you know, hit the freaking uh, gap over there and not make it. That would have sucked so hard, and I just KO'd him with a Pokeball. Wow. Items are doing a lot of good for me now. Alright, so Fox and Yoshi are next. Oddly enough, they're both in blue. Oddly enough, they're making me put me against my favorite Yoshi again. Like, they have something against me now. I, I'm pretty sure they have something against me. They want me to have a hard time sleeping at night. They don't like me. And I probably shouldn't have thrown that right next to Fox. Because now I gotta use one of the hearts. I don't have to, but I'm going to just for safety. Jigglypuff and Pichu. Oddly enough, they're both Pokemon. That's ironic again. And they're both green. That's really weird. I don't know why I pay so much attention to this stuff. I guess I just find it interesting sometimes. And 
Really? Did knock her out? Well, that did. That knocked him out. All right, that went quick. Yep, and now we got the Womp trophy. And it landed right on it, but not quite right. That transport me exactly there, oh well. Now we're up against Dr. Mario and uh, Roy. I love this music here. This is probably my second favorite track to Dr. Mario theme, and I shouldn't be standing by that many bombs. Very dangerous. I love the Dr. Mario theme. I like, wish I could have heard it longer, but... I say I had to knock him out, otherwise those bombs would have blew up, blew me up. This is probably my favorite stage overall. Just to... really, that's all it took. I don't know what my favorite stage is. This is definitely one of my favorites. I played this one so much when I was young, though. I just found it really freaking awesome. Oh, Pokeball! I want that. Come on, give me that. There we go. Caesar. That worked nicely. So yeah, I don't know what my favorite stage is. That's definitely one of my favorites. So, so now Mario, Falco, and Captain Falcon. My brother, and two guys with Falcon in their name somewhere. Irony? I'm not even going to bring that up right now. Like, that'll be the last time I bring up irony at all. For this video. I can't guarantee for the rest of the series because I do have one other request right now. I'm not sure if I'm going to get more. I hope I do because I'm actually having a blast with these. But, you know, we'll wait and see. And oddly enough, I KO'd him with a freaking freeze, Mr. Freeze. I did not think that would work. Oh, wait a minute. The bucket. Whoa. Didn't want that. Bowser, Donkey Kong, and Peach. I don't see much irony in there, do you? Okay, so I just took out Bowser really easily. So, and that was a lucky shot on Peach there. Or Daisy, I guess. She looked like Daisy. She must be Daisy. Alright, that, that worked. Took out Donkey Kong... So, now we move on to Samus, Mewtwo, and Ice Climbers. This is second to last one. So I can get out of here without too much damage. Because I want at least, I want a heart before the final battle. What can I say? I like it that way. And that's one Ice Climber, that's two, and that's one Mewtwo. Wow, that worked incredibly well. Just wow. I've gotten so lucky so many times so far in these videos. I only got one heart, so I'm going to have to push through against Marth, Kirby, and Zelda. And oh crap. I'm hurt badly now. That is not good. Alright, just got to worry about Sheik now. If I can just KO her. There we go. That worked. All right, so now we, ooh, trophy, we move on to Mr. Ah, oh, crap, that's right, I forgot, oh, crap, I'm going in without 0%, oh, that's bad, oh, that is so bad, I'm going to have to hope this move does it for me, Super Luigi, all right, it's doing it so far, I've eliminated a lot of them. And, uh, yeah, let's see if I can get this one guy. Not with that, obviously. With the capsule? No. No. Okay. Crap. Can't get him with the headbutt. Come on, get down here. Alright, Star Rod, that works. So, let's check out that final picture and trophy now. This one went by a lot quicker than I thought it would, honestly. Which amazes me. So, there's the Luigi trophy. Awesome. Skipping through the credits because I don't know anyone that cares about them yet. Okay, so that's that. 
Let's check out the last picture. Only 11 hits, but who cares? And what is it? Oh god, that picture is so wrong on so many levels. <laughs> Alright, so that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed. See you next video.